G'day guys, today we've got a chemistry question where we've been given a reaction between an acid and a carbonate and we're using titration volumes, we're being asked to find what the concentration of the acid is. So basically let's read through the question. We've got the student prepared one litre of 0.0248 moles per litre Na2CO3 solution. He titrated three 25 mil aliquots of the solution against the hydrochloric acid and found the average titration volume was 24.35. Calculate the concentration of the standardized HCl solution. Okay, so let's like figure out what we've got going here. To start with, we've got this 25 mils of Na2CO3. And we've got a, we've, it's being titrated against a hydrochloric acid solution that we're trying to find the concentration of. So we've been given the fact that we have three 25 mil aliquots of this solution against the hydrochloric acid and found the average titration volume was 24.35. All right, so let's see how we're going to do this. To start with, like we would do any so, sort of um, titration question or any acids and base question or any most, most, let me rephrase, most chemistry questions is we're going to work out what the uh, formula of this reaction is so we can figure out our uh, molar ratios of things. So we have a acid, which is hydrochloric acid. and a carbonate, so and that's going to give a salt which is NaCl plus water plus carbon dioxide. Great, so we'll just balance this we need two hydrogens on this side, and we're going to need two of those and two of those. Okay, so we're balanced. Great. The next thing we have to do is figure out the number of moles of Na2CO3 in the 25 mil aliquots that we've been given. So what we're going to do to figure that out is we're going to go the number of moles of Na2CO3 it's going to be equal to the concentration times the volume, which is equal to the concentration, 2.48 times 10 to the negative 2 times the volume, which is 25 mils, or 2.5 times 10 to the negative 2. Great. And that gives us a number of moles of 0 0.0062 mole. Now, from our reaction, we find that one mole of Na2CO3 requires two moles of hydrochloric acid. So from this, we can then deduce that the number of moles of hydrochloric acid in this 24.35 mil titration, the number of moles of that has to be, of hydrochloric acid, has to be equal to two times 0 0.0062, which is equal to 0 0.0124 mole in 24.35 mils. Cool. 
So we've been asked to work out the concentration of this. So from here, it's quite simple. We can just go the concentration of hydrochloric acid is equal to the number of moles divided by the volume. And this is going to be equal to 0 0.0124 divided by 0 0.02435. And with that, we get 5.1 times 10 to the negative 2 moles per litre. And that is our solution. So you can see it's not a very complicated question if we know sort of the um, correct way in which the titration is working as well as the correct molar volumes. As soon as we've got the formula and then we can calculate the number of moles of sodium carbonate in the 25 mil aliquots, then we can use molar uh, ratios to work out the number of moles of acid and then we can use uh, concentration is equal to number of moles over volume to work out the actual, the actual concentration of the acid. So I believe that the next part of this question was calculate the uh, pH of the hydrochloric acid, uh, the standard hydrochloric acid solution. But for this question, for this problem, we've just been asked to do this one. So I hope my explanation helped. Um, again, if you have any problems, feel free to send them to me, comment on the video if you have any problems with this particular question. And I like, I like to sort them out for everyone. It gives me a bit of pleasure. And, you know, do my channel a favor, subscribe to it, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you again next time.